Siroxat was launched in the early 90s, used to treat depression and anxiety disorders. It was a blockbuster drug, delivering big profits for GlaxoSmithKline. But now it's been accused of paying off other firms to delay launching cheaper copies. The Office of Fair Trading says that back in 2001, three rival companies were all trying to supply generic versions of this drug. GSK did a deal, but the OFT alleges this was market abuse, which denied the NHS of significant cost savings. Given that when a generic drug comes into the market, the price tends to collapse by about 75 percent, certainly up to 75 percent. And given that I've heard that Siroxat was worth approximately 100 million pounds, you could argue that maybe the saving would be up to 75 million pounds a year. GSK denies the allegations, saying, we support fair competition and we very strongly believe that we acted within the law. Huge fines could be levied if any of the companies involved are found to have breached competition laws. They have until August to submit their evidence, but it won't be until next year before the OFT delivers its findings. Emma Simpson, BBC News.